What's up everyone, TerraQuake here, and I'm back with my Pokemon Red Randomized Nuzlocke. And folks, it's time for what I'm hoping is the finale because, you know, I really wouldn't like to lose after I've done some grinding and we've got this amazing team. But anyways, if you missed the last episode, basically we got two brand new legendaries in Articuno and another Moltres. We defeated our rival and got all the way through, uh, or not all the way through Victory Road, but through most of it. And, um, before we get into stuff, um, first let me go over the items that I've got. I do have Elixir, or one Elixir, one Max Ether, and one Ether, which isn't as much as I want, but it's gonna have to do for our PP and stuff like that. But anyways, I've got 24 stores, 40 Max Potions, and 24 Full Heals, so, uh, and two Hyper Potions, so, um, you know, I think I can actually buy more because I did sell some things. But let's see, um, I'm at 9,431, 9 um, should we just get, I, I guess just get some more max potions, might as well, do we have enough, oh my gosh, I don't even have enough money, but, um, anyways, um, okay, I'm, I don't know, I'm just buying one, I think I've got enough, but, um, yeah, what I want to do quickly is do a team recap, I went back, I went, um, uh, well, first of all, you can see the levels. I've got them all up to level 57. I went back for all the trainers in Victory Road, and then I grinded some more on Wild Pokemon, and everyone is level 57. Now, really, I went back to the Celadon department store, and the DMs there were terrible, and I mean terrible. I mean, I, I got, um, I think Ice Beam was the best thing I got, and I taught it to Poliwrath. Barry got, I got, uh, Razor Leaf on it. I got rid of Absorb, and then... Oh no, he had Razor... Wait, did he have Razor Leaf last episode? I can't even remember. Um, I don't think I did anything with Axel. Except he did learn, um, Submission, I think. Unless that was last episode, I can't really remember. Saver, what do you have again? You got, um... What do you have? Yeah, you have Bubble. I taught Bubble to him. Um, he has Blizzard as well, and I went ahead and used some PP ups on Ice Beam. And, uh, I taught all of them Fly as well. I taught Barry... PKMN, because I couldn't, I mean, apparently there's not numbers, um, I taught Saber, and, um, both of them, I taught both of them fly, if I could find my words, but, um, Moltres, I think he's not too much different, I just fly, fire spin, peck, and leer, because I cannot find any fire TMs, which really stinks, but, um, it's gonna have to do, so, I'm a little nervous, but I'm also a little excited, because, um, here we go, I feel like level 57 is just, it's a good level, I know my rival's Pokemon are, like, in the low 60s, but we just gotta go, boys, we just gotta go, what's up, Lorelai? Here we go, um, again, this is, um, I'm just gonna, if the video does go past the timer, which most likely I think it will, um, I don't even have a timer, actually, so, yeah, okay, Snorlax. It's not the greatest thing, but, um, you know, I think I can deal with it. Let's see how much a Surf does. I guess I could go over to Axel, but I don't know. But, yo, this is kind of hype, dude. Oh, man, I'm so nervous, though. Okay, Rest, that's okay because we should be able to just three shot him because we outspeed. So that should be fine. I'm a little worried, though, about PP because, literally, I, um, only have one Max Ether. One max elixir, or I'm in mean, one elixir and one ether, so we could. I'm gonna have to preserve some PP, and it all depends on the randomizer, you know? Maybe I won't have to use as much if I, um, okay, use them. We should be able to finish off with Ice Beam, right? I hope so. Are you kidding? Don't use rest. Oh, wait. Oh, he wait. Oh, that's right. It generates in one. Um, snor, or you can't attack on the turn you wake up on, so that's nice. Um,. But yo, this episode, I'm just going to be focus mode, man. Don't want to make any stupid mistakes like I have in this series. I haven't made too many stupid mistakes, but sometimes they have led to deaths. So that's why. Alright. Rage, pointless move in Generation 1. But, um, yeah. Oh, and my dog just barked in the background. Oh my gosh, I didn't. I didn't kill him with the strength. Come on, man. Um, yeah. Sorry if you heard my dog. I don't know. I have my door shut. and Maybe you can hear him. Maybe you can't. Oh my gosh, a Mewtwo? Okay, Lorelai's got some good stuff, I'll go and say that, but you know what, this isn't all that bad, because if the randomizer were to give me a Mewtwo at any point, I'd like it to be here, when it's level 54, not when it's at my rival, and it's level 60, so, you know what, this is, should be okay, okay, that was a crit, 
It does outspeed. Oh, wait, no, we switched though. So, oh, wait, no, it does outspeed. Oh, that was a crit. Oh, we got it frozen. Yes, we got it frozen. Oh, let's go. And you can't unthaw in this game. So, unless she uses an item. Nope. Let's go, dude. We got pretty lucky with that freeze. Because that was a little bit spooky. Um, oh my gosh, she has a Vaporeon? Why do you have, like, everything, Lorelei? But like I said, I'd rather have all the good Pokemon be on Lorelei's team when they're, like, the lowest level. So, you know what? It's not that bad. Acid Armor? Oh, that raises your defense. Oh, man. I guess Slow Kick? How much is this gonna do? Hardly anything. Oh my gosh. Alright, a crit would be nice, Axel. Hydro Pump. Alright, that should do a lot, actually. Alright, we need a switch. <laughs> we'll, we'll go over to Dojo. Um, I bet you a Surf would do more now, actually, because I'm in more than a Strength, because literally, he's now at max defense. Yo, this battle, man, what a way to start it here. I love how uh, the freaking animation for Acid Armor literally makes you go invisible in Generation 1. It looks so dumb. Like It looks like Dojo's literally surfing against nothing. Oh my gosh, stop doing so much damage. I'm, I'm using a max potion, dude. Holy cow. But yeah, they didn't sell hyper potions there, so I just bought max potions. Um, Alright, yeah, see, nothing happened, because your defense is so high, Vaporeon. Anyways, uh, will this kill it? I think it might. Yes, I'll take the crit. Um, one more Pokemon left. Just be something easy. Come on. Uh, uh, whatever. I'll stay in. I mean, this is, eh. It's not what I really want, because again, I'm trying to save some PP, but with all these tough Pokemon, I'm having to use a bunch. But one more Ice Beam should do it. So we've gotten through Lorelei, but that's probably, I mean... I don't know, man. I'm, like I said, I'm excited but nervous. Level 58 for Dojo. I will take any level ups that we can get. And um, for dinner tonight, just to go off topic of all this craziness finale stuff. For dinner tonight, dude, I had the best flatbread I've ever had. It was like this buffalo chicken one. Ooh, it was so freaking good. I'll tell you that, man. It was amazing. Um, and usually I just don't get flatbread because like... I'm like, if they, I'm in pizza, I'll take pizza any day over flatbread. But that buffalo chicken flatbread, I'd take it any day over a cheese pizza. It was so good. Alright, anyways, um, let me go and switch up just to get, you know, people some action. But like I said, it's all based on the randomizer. Just depends on what I get, because some in my rival, he could have Caterpies and Weedles, and it'd be super easy, or he, had, or he could have Mews and Mewtwo's, and we could probably, if, if that's the case, we'd probably lose. Most likely. But here we go. Time for a Bruno. The second dude. What's up, Bruno? I think my levels are pretty good. I'm glad I grinded. I mean, I think I ended off the last episode around like the 50, 51. So, I think I did a pretty good job grinding. Hypno. Alright. Who do we have out again? Oh, yeah, we got. Alright, good thing I did switch because Hypno would be super effective. But nah, we got Barry out here. Ready to fly up in the sky. Okay, really? An X defend? What's with all these de defense boosts that uh, these people are using? Like, come on. Okay, stop. We get that you... You know what? I'm using Fire Spin. Of course I... I would miss Fire Spin, you know? I would. Alright, so it's gonna be a continuous attack because that's how it works in Generation 1. Oh, that was a critical hit. Oh my goodness. I I really wish I found the team for, like, Fire Blast or something. I'm gonna just keep on spamming Fire, spamming fire Spin because he can't do anything. So, um... I don't think they really heal in Generation 1. Okay, actually, I'm gonna go over to... Will Razor Leaf finish it? <sighs> a Razor Leaf will miss first. Alright, yeah, we good. This should kill it. Come on. I know his defenses are up, but like, come on, Barry, please. <gasps> yes, I'll take the crit. Again, I'll take it. Alright, next up. A Moltres. <laughs> what is with this, dude? What's my luck right now? Oh man, I haven't had one single, like, bad Pokemon yet. This isn't looking too good. But hey, maybe all the good Pokemon are coming out in the first two or three Elite Four members. So then, like, Lance and my rival will just be, like, awful Pokemon. Let's hope for that. Um, but yo, the crit on Moltres from the boy Dojo. Um, Butterfree. Okay, this is an easy Pokemon. We'll go right back out to Barry. Ooh, yeah, dude, this is epic, man. And if this is the finale... Then my new series, you you guys won't have to wait long for my uh, new series to start up because it will be starting on 
Monday, so what, this video goes up Friday, so three days from now. And I'm actually really excited for that series, man. Like I said, I'm playing through Pokemon Silver, but you know, Pokemon Silver, blank, blank. You can take your guesses in the comment section, even though I probably won't say the answer because I want to keep it a little bit of a secret. But what I'm actually going to do is I think I'm going to premiere it because, like, you know, why not? It's kind of cool to premiere some stuff. Um, Alright, Dodrio, we chilling right now. My boy Barry just going off. Hey, okay, drill pack. So I'll say if that's like, um, drill horn, horn drill. I'm so dumb. <laughs> drill horn. Yeah, it's Heraquake. It's drill horn. Okay. I right, rage, dude. Yeah, if you didn't know, rage is like a horrible move in Generation One. It just, it's awful. Oh, that was his last Pokemon. I didn't even know that. Okay, that was quick. Um, Barry basically sweeped almost his whole team, so. I'll take it. I'm gonna go ahead and use my last Hyper Potion, because, like, why not? I think after Agatha, I might need to use, like, a... At least an Aether or something. I don't know, because I don't... I'm not really sure where my PP is at. But anyways, third Elite Four member. Here we go. So far, so good. No deaths. Again, we also have Dhex, the Sand Slash, that if I do need to uh, sack off someone, it'll probably it'll probably be him. And I'm sorry, Dhex, but um, you're only level 25, so it's got him. Oh, Venusaur. You about to get one shot. But again, look at this. Like, I'm right now, I'm getting sort of unlucky with the randomizer. I'm like, come on. He's got an, all the elite four members. Besides that, um, who do you have? The Vulpix, I guess, wasn't that good uh, from Bruno. But, you know, I don't. All right, execute. There we go. There we go. There's an easy Pokemon to take out. Bet you we can just use Peck to take it out. No, I might actually live this. Oh my gosh. <gasps> yes, Sleep Powder Mist. I was about to say, dude. I would have gotten mad at myself there for freaking choosing Peck and then it not killing and Sleep Powder. Alright, Horsey, it's only a Horsey. It's not going to be able to touch my boy Barry. My boy Barry. Oh my gosh, she withdrew to Slowpoke. Okay, that's actually kind of spook. He can attack on this turn? Oh wait, no, it's because I came down from the sky. That's why I'm oh, so dumb. Alright, basically, see, this is why I've got Razor Leaf though. It's some good type cover for Barry. Um, I probably should have used it against Horsey, but whatever. Critical hit, I will take that. But yo, it's kind of fitting because I'm ending this off at uh, episode 20, you know, a good even number. It's a multiple of 10, it's just great, you know. Saying that this is the finale. If it's not, then we might be going to like episode 21 or 22. I don't know. Um, but yeah, because like I said, I have the revive feature. You can see it down there next to the team. And um, the layout, I mentioned it in the some previous episodes of this series, but I'm really going to try and, like, fix it up for my next series, because, um, I'm going to straight up admit it, this layout does not look good. Like, it was my first time making a Pokemon layout, and I don't think it's horrible for my first time, but to me, it's just not that good. <laughs> and, um, you guys can probably see that as well. Alright, so, you're just going to use Psybeam. Can that confuse me in this game? I know it can confuse you in later gens, but it don't matter, because it didn't confuse us here. So the Venonat goes down, and um, you know what? I don't think I'm going to use any uh, PP items because I'm actually good right now. So we've defeated Agatha. We have two battles left, man. It's going pretty good so far, but uh, knock on wood, I don't want to jinx it or anything like that. So uh, let's just see how this goes. All right. Let's do this. We're going to use uh, another max potion. On Barry, you know, get everyone fully healed. And we've got Axel up front. Hopefully, he can go to work. Um, oh, yeah, that's right. This is a long hallway to Lance. I don't know why Lance gets this little special long hallway to his room. And then the champion is like right after him. That makes no sense. But you know what? Whatever. I don't care because we're going to beat him right now, Lance. You think you're all cool in the Dragon Time Master? Well, you're about to have like Caterpie. Watch this. Imagine if he actually does have a Caterpie like to start. That'd be crazy. Well, here we go. Second to last fight. Oh my gosh, he had a Metapod. Okay, close enough. I mean, Caterpie, Metapod, really, what's the difference there? But that's kind of hilarious, actually. Um, Crytop, okay, that really didn't do that much. Does Bug resist fighting in this game? Indeed it does. So, oh, we got a flinch, though, so I'll take it. This should kill it, right? Yeah, I'll take the crit as well. Next up, we've got Psyduck. Easy, man. Easy. See, I'm telling you, the tough Pokemon were earlier on. Okay, we missed. He's got Confusion. Aha. Doesn't even do anything. It's not Stab. We're good. My boy Axel can take that easily. 
Let's go. Another crit. Okay. Ditto. All right. He's going to... Is he going to outspeed me? Yes, he does outspeed me. This should be a one shot. Right? Yes, sir. All right. Because if he did transform into a Machamp, that actually kind of be a little scary. But you know what? It's all good. Bulbasaur. <laughs> oh, man. What is your team, Lance? Hopefully, my rival is like this. I really hope my... Mm, I don't really like you putting me to sleep. That's kind of annoying. Because, you know, I think... I think in Generation 1, um, you can't, you, you can stay asleep for it. Okay, really? There's no way he's predicting that I'm using a full heal. Okay, there we go. But yeah, I think you can stay, you can still wake up, but like, if you just get insanely unlucky, you can stay asleep for a very long time. I think that's how it works in these games, I don't know. To be honest, if, I mean, you know, what am I trying to say? I don't know, I lost my words, but um. It's Generation 1, basically, so, uh, you know, you could list off anything, and anything that sounds crazy, and it'd actually probably be in these games, so, yeah, anyways, Karate Chop going to work, Acid, <laughs> Acid's not gonna do anything, look at that, oh my gosh, I'm walking, like, 20 hit points or whatever, well, we have defeated Lance, and there's only one battle remaining, guys, this is going a lot smoother than I thought it would, you know, the start, like I said, was a little scary, but, uh, now we've got a rival, aka Bab, meant to name him Baby. I gotta think of a name for my rival in the next series, the um, Silver. I could just call him Silver, but let's be honest, that's kind of boring. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and use all my PP restoring moves. I'm mean, not moves, items. I sort of forget. Alright, we have an Ether. Um, I think Surf needs one. And then we'll use an Elixir with the um, Berry, yeah. And then, wait, don't I have some? Yeah, I have a Max Ether. So we can use that on Karate Chop, I guess. I mean, these are, I really haven't used, like, my other Pokemon that much. So, uh, hey, I'll take it. All right, here we go. Fully healed. It's time for the final fight versus our rival. I was looking forward to seeing you, TQ. My rival should be strong and keep me sharp. While working on Pokedex, I looked all over for powerful Pokemon. Not only that, I assembled teams that would beat any Pokemon type. And now... I'm the Pokemon League Champion. TQ, do you know what that means? I'll tell you, I'm the most powerful trainer at the world! Shut up, you're about to lose. Here we go. Oh, look at this. I mean, listen to this music, man. It's great. Full team of six. Scyther? <laughs> Scyther. Okay, I, I do have Axel out right now, though, but we're about to go into Barry. PKMN, aka Barry Pokemon, aka Barry 2.0. You get the point. Let's get it. Fly. He's just gonna use agility. Like that's gonna do anything. Oh no, agility! I'm so scared. Um, will this one shot? Oh, I feel like he's gonna heal it, won't he? Oh no, he's just gonna use double team. All right, please don't miss Peck. Isn't Peck like 100 accuracy? Oh my gosh. Oh okay, Peck. We need a hit right now. Thank you. Whew, he's starting to use Swords Dance, and he had agilities up as well. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> You guys seeing this? It's a Pidgeot on the field? Like, what? thought he said he got Pokemon from all around the region to be any type, and you're gonna have Pidgey? <laughs> okay. I'm just kidding, guys. I know it's a randomizer. Oh, what's up next? Oh, a Lapras. Now, that is a little scary, but we do have... Where to go? Axel. We do have Axel, and you know what? I'm going all out. Even though it's gonna do some recoil damage, we're gonna go with the submission. Oh, we missed... Oh, he missed two. Alright, it's all good. It's all good, dude. Got me a little worried. Submission? Almost gonna take him out. Gonna do a lot of recoil. Oh, please don't kill me. Oh, please don't kill me. I, I know Machamp's special isn't that good. Oh, we hung on. We hung on 39 health. Alright, don't miss. Yes, this should knock him out. Alright, dude. That was a little scary. Lowest health we've been all episode. But hey, three down, three to go. He's got a slow, bro. I don't really like the looks of a slow bro, but um, gosh, slow bro definitely does wall me because it's part of psychic. Ooh, okay, so let's do a. I would try and freeze them or something, but I think fly is just a better choice. Water gun, that's fine. Water gun will hardly do anything. Fly's not gonna do much, but water gun's not gonna do anything. Could be a while before he goes down. Uh, let's see, amnesia, fine. Wait, fly, that's gonna be physical on his hand, right? Yeah, because it's only it's the evolutions. Plus dragon typing, I think, is what it is. I think that's... Or at least for Generation 1, I know that. That's like the little saying. Eevee Lucians 
add on a dragon type, bam, you got the special types in Generation 1. Alright, so all Silver wanted to do was use Water Gun and then Amnesia, so that's A-OK. -okay. Two Pokemon left, it's a Marowak. <laughs> we about to hit you with a Blizzard, a DQ Blizzard right here. You know how they flip it upside down and, and when they give it to you, you're like, oh shoot, it, it, it stayed in the cup. Well, Marowak, he just got flipped upside down his head. And then his last Pokemon, I forgot he had the Raticate. Another Blizzard. Okay, quick attack. Quick attack, guys. I think... I think... Mm, will this be the final hit? He's eight levels above me. Hey! Critical hit from the boy Saber. Clap it up, boys. We have defeated our rival in the final battle in this game. Meaning I have completed my Pokemon Red randomized Nuzlocke, which is awesome. And I am the new Pokemon League champion. That is right. Um, but yo, that was so fun to do. Holy cow. I love doing this series. And as you can tell, those two legendaries that I caught in the last episode, they definitely helped. If I just went in here with a Poliwrath Machamp and my original Moltres, I don't think I, um... I don't think I would have uh, done, I might have not even made it to my rival. Those first two battles were definitely tough, but this got easier as we went, and whew, it's good. We didn't even have to use our revive. We got, what, two deaths this whole series, unless I'm counting wrong. I mean, we had Rob and um, Boomerang, the Marowak, that died like way back in Lieutenant Surge's gym. Um, so, I, I don't know. I feel like there's someone else that I might have missed. Let me know. In the comment sections if I did, because then I'll probably like have to add it onto the death count or something like that. I don't know. But it's all good, babe, because I, I want to see my team in the Hall of Fame. Here we go. Professor Oak congratulating us. But anyways, yeah, that's my Pokemon Red Randomized Nuzlocke. We have beaten the game. And um, again, you won't have to wait long for my next series. It's going to be Monday, three days from today. It's going to be Pokemon Silver something something. Not going to tell you yet. But um, also for that game, I don't think I'm going to go through Kanto because literally I just played through Kanto. So as of now, I'm probably not going to go through it and I probably won't end up going through it anyways. I'll just go through Johto and, you know, beat the whole main part of the game. It would be sort of fun to go all the way to Red, but that would just take like another, you know, 10 episodes at least or something like that. But hey, we got Axel, level 57, the Machamp, found him in the Dojo, right? The Saffron Dojo. Next up, we have Saber, the Articuno, at level 57. You know, we're acknowledging all of my amazing teammates. Um, which Moltres is this? This is Barry PKMN, aka Barry 2.0, aka the, sec the unoriginal Barry, level 57 as well. We got Dojo here from the beginning at level 58. He was our starter Mon. And this is our original berry. Found him in the Diglett's Tunnel, I believe, at level 58. And then we have <gasps> D-Hex, the level 25 Sand Slash. Hey, he was um, in the party giving my team some moral support and everything like that, which is awesome. And there I am, TQ, 28, that's 28 hours, 59 minutes. You're on the right track, uh, sure. I get a Flash HM. Yeah, like I'm going to get a Flash HM. All the way at this point in the game but um anyways uh now the credits are gonna roll so um yeah that's it for this series i do want to you know shout out my boy rob wish he was still with us instead i had to dump him in the pc because he died shout out to my boy boomerang aka the marowak died all the way back at lieutenant surge's gym wish he was still on the team but you know what what can i do anyways um like i said that's it for my series i really hope you guys enjoyed it i'm glad that you know I was able to finish it off on a good note, winning it. And like I said, a new series starting Monday as long as I can get everything done in time. Because again, I'm recording this almost a week before it's going up. Or about, wait no, six days before it's going up. So, you know, I haven't even really started on the layout and everything for that um, series. But I'm really going to try and make it look a lot better than this one. So yeah, look forward to that. And like I said, I'm thinking about premiering it. So you guys will probably see the premiere like the night before or something like that. Which should be pretty epic. But uh, yeah, for now... I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, then drop a like, subscribe, hit the bell so you don't miss my next upload. You guys know what to do. I had so much fun making this series. But, um, and that's all I've got. So, until next time, deuces.